Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Keeper deck from Illusionist.com. All right, so this is a deck that was designed in partnership between Adam Wilbur and Oben Jones. Oben Jones is uh, one of the new illustrators down uh, there at Illusionist. He's been doing a bunch of new decks, and so this is uh, one of his latest. So the theme for uh, this deck, Keeper, is lighthouses. So lighthouse, lighthouse keeper, that kind of thing. So it says Keeper across the front, there's a lighthouse right there, and it does say playing cards. On this side it says performance coding and professional quality. And on this side there's a quote from Mehmet Mirat Ilden. He is a Turkish novelist and playwright, and he says on the side, Seek not a lighthouse greater than the human mind. On the bottom, there is some ad copy about Illusionist. And then the back side is actually a depiction of the Joker, not the back of the cards. And so there's the Lighthouse Keeper, it says Keeper, and then there's some uh, little description about the theme of the deck. The tuck top says standard size, standard face. And then right here on the flaps, there are the initials, both of Adam Wilbur and Open Jones. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards are printed from the United States Playing Card Company and they do come on their retail stock. They are a modern cut with air cushion embossing. And if you'd like to learn more about stock, cut, or finish, you can click the link below in the description. All right, so one of the things uh, that Illusionist is saying in their ad copy is how uh, different these cards feel compared to another deck of cards. Um, they go on and on and on about how great they feel, um, how uh, just professional they're gonna feel, how great they're gonna handle straight out of the box, and they say they will pass a blindfold test that you will be able to tell the difference between these and a standard deck of bikes. And I would say that is completely true. Now, let me tell you why it's true, okay? Let me tell you why it's true. First of which is, this is a Q1 deck from Bicycle, okay? Q1 means that it's done with the most strictest quality controls. So all custom decks are given a Q1 quality control, okay? The only decks that are not are the decks that Bicycle prints for retail. So any deck that you would buy off the shelf Okay, one of the standard bikes, whether it's you know, My Little Pony or the decks for Shark Week, those are all done just at the factory, you know, willy-nilly, like Illusionist says, to get done thousands of sheets at a time. Any Q1 deck though, any quality one deck that is a custom design. So again, any deck from Illusionist or any deck that is custom printed receives this Q1 quality. So right off the bat, I would say any Q1 deck, any custom deck, in a blindfold test, you'd be able to tell the difference between any custom deck and a bike deck off the shelf, okay? That's a given. So I would argue that you could make that claim about any Illusionist deck. Second reason why you can tell the difference between this deck and a deck of bikes off the shelf is because of the thinness of this stock. This deck is incredibly thin. In fact, when I measured this with the caliper, it received the lowest number I've ever measured any deck of cards that I've been doing since I started measuring cards, okay? This is now the lowest, smallest number. So these cards are incredibly thin. So yes, in a blindfold test, if you were feeling the thick uh, bike cards against these thin keepers, you would absolutely be able to tell the difference. So the reason why these, uh, you can tell the difference between these and a regular deck of bikes in a blindfold test are because, number one, it is a custom deck. Custom decks have much smoother edges, more rounded corners, better registry, and then of course because it is a very extremely thin stock. Some people like thin stock, some people like the fact that they come out of the box feeling like they're already broken in. Some people prefer stiffer stock, some people prefer a casino grade stock. So if you like casino grade cards or thicker stock, this is the complete this is the complete opposite direction. With every purchase of the Keeper deck from Illusionist, you will also receive a shameless plug 
This is a downloadable uh, video that you can watch uh, from Adam Wilbur, and he is teaching you a trick that he does with his business card. And so every person who receives the Keeper Deck will also receive that link. The Keeper Deck is a tribute to the Bicycle Standard Rider 808 back. Um, you can see that dead center there is the triptych circles, just like the bicycle cards, although the bicycle has been replaced with a lighthouse. However, this deck is only uh, available in blue, and so you can only get that some blue. And it is kind of reminiscent of the bicycle blue. You do have the uh, thick poker border around the edge, as well as the inner border of the vine work, and uh, it does have that feel of uh, a classic bike deck. It does give you all the pros of having a bicycle deck, something that looks standard, something that looks traditional. I don't think any lay person would ever say, oh, that's a custom deck, that's not, you know, I don't think they would ever think that this was a, a custom deck at all. And so uh, this is a wonderful deck to have to perform with either magic, uh, gambling routines, or flourishing. Also with this deck, you will get a couple of extras, one of which is an illusionist ad card that contains the illusionist.com URL. You will also get two identical jokers. Again, the picture that is on the back of the tuck case. It is a happy lighthouse keeper uh, standing in front of a silhouette lighthouse in the back. Also included with the keeper deck is an extra card. Now, sometimes this is better than actually getting a gaff card. Uh, receiving an extra card has just as many uh, possibilities, one of which is card to impossible location. And so with this deck, you will get two queen of hearts. Your ace of spades has a beautiful a large pip there in the center with the lighthouse uh, and it's light. Also at the bottom it says the Illusionist Playing Card Company, made in the USA. All the pips and indices in this deck are completely standard and you will recognize each and every one of them. However, there are two custom court cards. There is a custom Jack of Clubs, which is Adam Wilbur, and a custom Queen of Clubs. All right, so that is it for the Keeper Deck from Illusionist.com as well as Adam Wilbur and Oban Jones. As always, I recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magicorthodoxy, twitter.com slash magicorthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magicorthodoxy.com. Thanks. Bye.